Good morning, afternoon, evening, whichever time you're watching. My name is Adam, and this is Get Pipes, where we, well, love to pipe. Uh, today's going to be a little bit different of a video. We're going to be doing an unboxing of a care package I received. And by care package, I mean I used my dollars to purchase something online, and then they sent me the products that I purchased. That package is from Ladisi Enterprises, aka smokingpipes.com. Now the question is, what is inside this box? I have no idea. I purchased it a couple weeks ago and I genuinely don't remember what's in it. I remember checking the tracking to see if it would get here every single day. I just forgot what I ordered, so I don't know. We'll see. This is actually kind of a big box, so um, we're going to find out what's in this box. We're going to do it together as a team, two men and women or somewhere in between that like to be piped well i guess we'll just get right into it okay that's why you cut out words not in words remember that all right the big reveal here it comes make this like an asmr That was stupid. Okay, let's see. Got any pipes laying around? Oh, I got some pipes laying around. Ever heard of them? I'll be honest, I don't know why I had that many pipes just sitting <laughs> right there. All right, useless information there. Oh, we got a, what? What the hell? I thought I got one pipe. There's some goodies in here right now. Let's start with this guy. Let's start with this guy. If, if you, you know what this is. This is a beautiful package from Peterson of Dublin. I don't remember what it is though. I don't buy pipes all willy nilly. Okay, so I buy pipes all willy nilly, but let's open it up. Cut away from you. Remember that. A wise man. Maybe woman said that. My father told me to do that, and I was like, I think I can't control a knife. <clears throat> right, let's get this box out of the way. Here we go. There's nothing better than, like, getting a pipe box, too. I don't know what I thought would smell in there. All right, the big reveal. What's it going to be? Seems to be a straight, like maybe a billiard. I do not remember. This is so weird to me. Ooh, okay. Okay. This is pretty, man. This is pretty. Irish made. I, why did I buy this? Oh, it's a um an army what do you call this uh the army army mount the uh irish army mount i wanted one of these really bad i was looking for a p-lip because these are a cheaper pipe uh and i was like oh i could get one uh, i want to kind of like a more everyday peterson i have a couple but i wanted another one so it does have a fishtail does not come in the p-lip which is very unfortunate because i do i love the p-lips but um yeah this is freaking awesome it's a great size this is the 101 that's right that's a good size. I, I remember reading that the, uh, I think it's the 102 was a little bit smaller. And I was thinking about getting that, but I was like, you know what? Maybe I could get like a nice, a little bit slightly chunkier. So they said it was, there's like a bigger version. I don't remember what, the 106 maybe? I don't know. I'm not super, I gotta look at the numbers. No, I don't just remember all the numbers, but uh, yeah, this is pretty cool. I think they're called the Irish Maid. This is really, really awesome. Yeah, I'm a huge fan of this. Good clenching. I prefer a smaller bowl. I like I like how they look. They feel a lot better, easier to clench. Um, they're kind of annoying to pack, but I do prefer a smaller bowl. But I wanted to go out of my way and get a little bit bigger. The grain is absolutely 
beautiful. I love it. Yeah, there we go. And it is in the fishtail, so to kind of give me a break from all my peelips. So yeah, really awesome. So let's check out what else we got, though. Don't remember getting anything else. I knew there was a Peterson pipe. I just didn't remember which one. Now, the other things, one or two things, I'm not really quite sure. Maybe more, hopefully not more. I don't know what's in there, so we're going to find out right now. I am now remembering as I'm grabbing it. At least this part. A white box. <laughs> Yes. This game's fun. Maybe I should start ordering more stuff and uh, forgetting what I... Maybe just keep them in boxes and forget. And of course, it's another Peterson product. This is going to be a beautiful, absolutely beautiful Peterson Irish whiskey flask. I have used a whiskey flask, I think maybe once in my life. Why did I purchase this? Great question. I don't know. But I will tell you, it is absolutely beautiful. Look at that stitching. Very, very high quality. This is only like $30. Um, I purchased another one online from a Facebook group and yeah, I, it was just like the regular silver one. I was like, you know what? I don't love the silver. So I was like, let's get the, uh, let's check out. Let's look online and see, see what else they have. And they have this very, very beautiful uh, leather wrapped whiskey flask. So we got the flask and it also has a little uh, funnel to pour your whiskey. And imagine that. So yeah, very awesome. I, I, I am a huge, you guys will soon see that I'm a huge fan of Peterson. I don't think they're the best smoking pipes in terms of quality, smoking experience, but they are my favorite brand, if that makes sense. The bias, a little bit of Irish in me, a little, little Irish in my blood. Directions for use. Directions more like directions. It says cheers. That's a bummer. Should say slancha, whatever. Yeah, really, really cool. So we're actually going to put this right back in the case. Oh, it's got the Peterson of Dublin on the bottom. I'm getting my fingerprints all over it. Nice little presentation there. Okay, for the last thing, I have no idea what this is. It is a, maybe a, a cardboard box wrapped in uh, this paper stuff. I have no clue, uh, no idea. And I, I'll tell you what, it is not tobacco. That's the thing, it is 100% not tobacco. I cannot order tobacco into the state of Washington where I currently live. Not overly ideal there, but um. so I know it's not tobacco. So we'll, well, let's see, let's see. It is a, another Peterson product. Okay, did not recall getting three Peterson products in one purchase. Yeah, kind of an interesting little uh, container. What, what could it be? If you have one of these, you're probably commenting right now, you dumbass, you idiot. How do you not remember purchasing this awesome product? That's right. It is. Very, very beautiful tobacco container. I have this problem where I travel a lot for work and I don't have an efficient way of, of transporting tobacco. Normally I just keep them in the tin, maybe even a bag. But as you know, if you're an experienced pie smoker, the bag is horrible. They get holes in them, the tobacco dries out. So I found this, um, I think they're pretty new, so I'm not sure. So let me know if any of you guys happen to have one of these or some form of them, um, you know, definitely let me know. But this thing's freaking awesome. We're gonna open it up real quick. It's just a, basically a very high quality tobacco. Oh, this is awesome. I am, I'm cheesing over this. I don't know how much it can hold, but it looks like a decent amount. Very, very, very sturdy, which is really awesome. And the zipper is very high quality. This is a really, really awesome product from Peterson. I remember it being very cheap. Like I didn't spend a ton of money because I wanted a cheap pipe, cheap flask. I think the flask was $30. And then I think this was probably around $30 too, maybe even a little bit cheaper, which is really freaking awesome. So I'm a huge fan of this. Of course, they got their little P zipper. And then you got the, the inside. What is this called? What do they call this? This is a, uh, I forget what they call this. I'm not going to look it up. I'm just going to remember it. Of, of, a voca jar of avoca, avoca, of 
Avoca? Avoca jar. It's like the Peterson Avoca jar. Basically, I'm assuming that's just a jar that uh, has this stuff. And it, I don't know, I guess it keeps tobacco very, very well. So uh, very, very cool. This is awesome. I'm so excited to use this. This is one of those things where you can just throw it in a bag, um, keep it in your car, and it's not gonna, it's not gonna dent unless you like actually drop like a heavy weight on it. Uh, your tobacco is going to be just fine. Very, very high quality for, for a decent, decent price. So that's pretty much it. If you have any questions on any of these, like to see how, how this is, I'm actually going to test this out. So leave a comment and then I'll get back to you and I'll let you know. Uh, what, what was the other thing? Oh, the flask. The flask was pretty cool. Don't know when I'm going to use that. Probably just going to sit on a shelf. Uh, but like I said, I'm a huge fan of Peterson and, and um, it might be the a little bit Irish in me, but I, I really do appreciate the uh, the company. And there's like an amazing video from Peterson on YouTube that uh, it shows like their craftsmanship, but it is a huge pipe factory. So they are factory pipes. But despite being a factory pipe, every single pipe that gets pushed out of Peterson's factory is touched in some capacity by a human being, which is really awesome. Just like Missouri Meerschaum, where they put out millions of piping pipes a year. I think it's like 2 million pipes a year. If I remember correctly, that could be completely wrong. Might just edit that part out, but a lot of pipes from these two companies and they are every single one is, is in old by hand, whether it's this stain hand stained or, um, the touch-ups on like the, the sanding, whatever it might be, the stems, whatever it is, there's human hands that are touching this pipe on each stage of production, which is super, super awesome. So Peterson is a great workman's pipe it's a great gentleman's pipe ladies pipe i just think they're freaking awesome they just have such a history such a story to them and especially being of irish make you know the, the irish people have endured so much their fighting rebellious spirit you know lives on in every single pipe that comes out of the peterson factory so i'm a huge fan of peterson that's why i got all this stuff let me know if you have any questions i'm going to be continuing to do a little bit more videos like this a little bit different from just instructional videos but yeah let me know leave a comment let me know what you think about peterson and dumbling do you have any do you like them do they suck some of mine do some of mine do yeah that is for sure thank you guys so much for checking this one out my name is adam this is get piped until the next piping i'm out